Hi, welcome to the Snooker World Championship at the Crucible Theatre in Sheffield 2023 vlog. My first ever Snooker World Championship at the Crucible Theatre in Sheffield 23, 23 vlog and possibly my last. So my intention for this particular vlog is to follow the adventures of myself, my brother James and my friend Des as we travel to the steel city of Sheffield and in particular the Crucible Theatre to capture some second round matches at the Snooker World Championship. Tickets for this evening's evening session matches which are between Mark Selby and Gary Wilson and C. Jawi against Robert Milkins. Uh, rendezvous with rendezvous with James there as you can see. Hello. Hi James and we're just uh, we've just left Swindon station so we'll be uh, going to Paddington now and from there we will be travelling to St Pancras station where we will be rendezvousing with Des. Welcome to London St Pancras station. Please remain seated until the a queuing system will be in place for all teams linked East Midlands Railway Services. But we have arrived in Sheffield. Here, the superb Moneybrook House in Sheffield, and as you can see, we're joined now in this crucial opening frame between Des Torpy and James Nichols. But I'll show you around the rest of the place because it is quite superb. I'm sure, Des, you'd agree. Oh, lovely, lovely spot, lovely spot. Uh, yeah. table is the main feature of the house. Let's just see if James gets on with this rest shot. Tough shot that, but um, yeah, he's left everything available there for Des. But uh, let me show you around the rest of the place. We've got our toilet in here. This is to the neighbouring property. We've got a toilet in the bath in there. This is Mark and Des's bedroom for the evening. Um, very nice. A little view out the window there as well. Beautiful. Nice cosy little room. Oh, he's behind me. Great. There's Mark's bed. And uh, let's go and have a look at the uh, the crowning glory of this property. Right, I'm going to try not to fall down these stairs. Your shot there. And we've got ourselves a lovely little bar area here. Um, presuming that the... I'm pr yeah. presuming that that's not <laughs> not working yeah. but and the snooker table as soon as you come in lovely I think there's probably their yeah, lights but there you go yeah. look at that and yeah we've got a little tribute to nice. Sheffield's nice. snooker history around here as well so yeah all in all for a hundred pounds a night or so between us, between us yeah. can't knock it cheers Head down to where are we going, lads? The Crown. The Crown. Crown Pub. Um, have a quick pint in there. Then we're going to go to. Um, we'll get a grab a taxi from there. Head into Sheffield to get some food, and then we'll be making our way to the Crucible for our pilgrimage.
Yeah. All right, boys. All right. All right. Here um, we are. In the theatre of dreams. Looking forward to the uh, match now. Um, any f predictions, lads? Uh, well, we, don't get, we, don't get, we don't get to see it to a close, but um, I think that Selby will open up a relatively healthy 5 uh, 3 lead. Lovely. 6 2. 6 2 Selby? 6 2 Selby. And but haven't you got a bet on the other lad winning the session, though? Uh, I have, and I've also get, got a bet on uh, C. Jui yeah. to uh, win the other match. Hopefully the uh, curtain will go up and we'll see a bit of both matches. I think that uh, uh, C. Jui will win the other game quite comfortably. I think that Milkins has had a good season, but I think that um, he, will, he will win that match and probably 6-2, maybe even a 7-1 lead. Today. See you in there. Thank you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We started last Saturday with 32 of the finest players on the planet. Now, only the top 12 remain. So far, five former champions have fallen, but three are still in contention. You can sense the pressure beginning to bubble in this crucible cauldron. So welcome back for the climax of day eight at the Kazoo World Super Champions. Thoughts on uh, thoughts on that uh, match, Mark. It's ended uh, five three to Mark Selby. It was hard work, wasn't it? Um, yeah, possibly the, one of the worst things I've ever seen. <laughs> um, certainly, snooker wise, the wor easily the worst snooker match I've ever seen. Um, but yeah. Turgid, wasn't it? Really, really bad. Gr really grueling. bad. Grueling. Yeah. Awful. Uh, there, walking past in the background. Awful. Terrible. Four, four, four and a half hours. Yeah, it's bad. To play eight frames. Really bad. The first two frames were right after that. Pretty much right, so we're throughout. It's cool. That's the thing. Waited two hours for a taxi <laughs> after a um, rather sluggish match between um, Mark Selby and Gary Wilson. So not the most successful of evenings thus far. Um, spirits, I would say, medium to low. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we had a good day yesterday. The only uh, low light being the actual snooker itself. Um, but we had a good day, had a good few uh, a few drinks, a good uh, look around the city, Good, great place where we're staying, good few frames of snooker in there. Uh, Des and James, any final thoughts to share? Uh, yeah. it was, it's, been a, it's been a pleasant weekend, but um, yeah, the snooker was pretty pretty dreadful, but um, it's nice to be here, lovely place, and uh, yeah, thanks for your company. Yeah, I, I couldn't agree more. I would chalk the snooker matchup as being the, one of the worst experiences of mine, or indeed anyone else's life. <laughs> so thank you, Mark Selby and Gary Wilson, yeah. for the... Um, for the game, yeah, terrible. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe.